Welcome back to the week 2 technology tutorial for the Positive Learning for University course. In this clip we are looking at creating a new gallery page. To do this we will go up to our create a new page tab and the following screen should appear. Click on gallery pages You can choose between thumbnail, horizontal, vertical and slideshow. Today we are going to stick with a simple thumbnail and I'm going to do one with the same ratio. Click select. Next we are going to name our page. Then we are going to add files by clicking on the add files button. Select the files you want in the gallery. And then click open. Then click start upload. On the right hand side you will see that as they are uploaded each one will hit 100% and a little tick will appear beside it. You can also see how big the files are. Of course the larger the files are the longer it will take to upload. Additionally a small box stating that the image is saved appears on the right hand side. Once your files have finished uploading the screen will drop down to an images box where you can add text, product options, delete the images or sort them into a different viewing order. To sort them you just click on the little cross on the right hand side and drag them up or down to place them in any order you'd like. Once you've done this, return to the top of the screen. Add your page to the menu and go to the See Live button at the top of the page. There you have your gallery. At this point, if you would like to edit the page, you can go to the bottom right hand corner and click on the Portfolio Box button. That will bring up a pop-up box with your editing menu. Click on edit this page. From there you can change the template you use. You can change the display settings. Pick images for anything from small through to extra large. You can choose the image view you'd like to use and of course you can change the settings. And finally you can choose to make it your start page. To hide the edit boxes simply click the top portfolio box and it will drop them down to the bottom corner out of the road. We now have a gallery page of images. Thank you for trying Portfolio Box. I hope you've enjoyed the week 2 exercise in the technology component of your Positive Learning for University course. Next week we will be looking at online cloud data storage with Dropbox. See you then.